Doors open. Yo, Trey. What's going on, bro? Look at this, man. <sighs> look at this, bro. Look at this ridiculousness. This happens every day now. Look, man, if it's another black man getting killed by the cops, bro, I'm good off that, man. Bro, just because you're not paying attention doesn't mean it isn't happening. Bro, it's not that I'm not giving it attention, bro. It's just like, it's too much negative energy and it's too early in the morning for all that. Early in the... It's the afternoon. Damn near one o'clock. But look, right now we living in crucial times, bro. Yeah. All right? Something's got to give or nothing is going to change. That's facts, bro. I mean, like, I'd rather talk about a solution rather than talking about how hard it is for us blacks in America. Bro, either one of us can become hashtags tomorrow. True. I'd rather find a solution that will prevent our kids from going through what we went through. Big facts. I can get with that. Yeah, I feel you. But you know, I can't front, like, you know, we live two different experiences, though. Like, what do you mean? I mean, even though we're both black, we live two different lives. We live in the same neighborhood, right? Yeah. Move in the same circles? Yep. Got the same ancestry, huh? Maybe. Yeah. How the hell are we different, Jimmy? Okay. Well, for one, both of my parents are black. So you're saying I ain't black because my mother's white? Look, man, I'm not saying that. Trey, look, I'm not coming for your blackness. You're just as black as I am. I'm just saying, like, it's two different experiences, man. Like, look, you're black, like, in here. I'm black like this. I can't turn that off. That's what I'm saying. So you're saying if we get pulled over by the cops, they gonna care about who blacker? All right. Hmm? We gonna be two suspects, guilty until proven innocent. Facts, but if you took your do-rag off, tuck in your chain, shave off your beard, and shop that Lululemon, I guarantee you, white people will feel a lot more comfortable around you. That's crazy. That's not crazy, that's facts. It doesn't matter if I dress preppy, it doesn't matter if I speak the Queen's English, I could have a PhD. When people see me, all they see is black. When they see you, they good, they comfortable. Look, all I'm saying is, you can pass if you want to. Look, man, it's tough enough to be the Negro in white spaces. Now I gotta turn around and try to prove my identity to my own people. Look, I ain't trying to compare no struggles or nothing like that. But no one ever asked you about your blackness. Trey. You were comparing apples to oranges. I'm really not trying to hear that. Oh my God, it's a struggle to be light-skinned in America. I'm not trying to hear that right now, bro. Because at the end of the day, you will always be seen as more acceptable because your skin tone makes you less of a threat. Less of a threat, but still a threat, Jimmy. Why are we going back and forth on this? How are we gonna fight against the real enemy and we fighting amongst ourselves? Light skin against dark skin. Black against Hispanic. African against the rest of the diaspora. Who the hell cares, Jimmy? We all black. And all in a country who love what we can bring to the table. But hate us for existing. You right. You right. I ain't trying to be. So how do we fix it? 